LDV1, the application of a lymph and interstitial fluid to viscera. For example, here, our assessment is always is I find a little pool between the stomach and esophagus, abdominal esophagus and the liver. That's a smaller momentum, deep. I'm going to continue that pool, so which means I cannot open it as well. I'm going to continue that pool to the point of re release of balance and then send the lymph up. Sometimes you have to do one more time. Lymph to the cistern achille. The liver has two directions. Until the body release. <laughs> nice release. And then you can spread that smaller, smaller momentum. You are done for that lesion. And then we found another lesion. Yes, there. By doing this, you can feel there's a geyser. There's a little indication that something else is wrong here. And this time, it's not an interface between two organs, such as stomach, esophagus, and liver. This time, it's inside the cecum. So intraparenchyma, intraorgan. And the cecum has a little twist. And we use the same technique to go with it and send the fluid to the superior mesenteric nodes and you release and we have some space there and I think we have a tiny bit of the leucycal valve right there so I'm going to go with it feel that ease tell me there's a tension on the other side and send the fluid where it wants to go you make a little switch And you come back. How does it feel? That's good. Mm -hmm. All right, feel a little bit. Breathe. How does it feel? It feels much more fluid and open. Yeah. So we address the lesion in the fluid and in the fascia at the same time. So usually the release is, is, uh, is very. Uh, something you can really feel. Mm -hmm.